their sign of Aquarius. This is Kim here to do your reading for you for your next 48 hours. Thank you for being patient with me while I got these out, guys. Thanks for your likes, shares, subscribes, comments. Um, right now, we're going to call in your spirit guides, angels, higher self, higher power to get messages for Aquarius, to move them forward always as clear and concise as you can be. Dream totems, and that's the dream totem on the back of that card there. Looks like a fly. Uh, indifference. Some things are worth worrying over, but this isn't one of them, Aquarius. Let this situation go and reclaim the happiness that's been stolen from you via past events. Okay, moving on, the Archangel deck. So you're indifferent to something, or the suggestion is to be indifferent to something, impartial, because, um, well, that would be an easy thing for Aquarius to achieve. They do know how to detach um, so that they can practice what they need to be focusing on, really, to not be distracted. So, Archangels, who is with our original thinkers? Oh, my goodness. Wow. 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 You got, I mean, I, I know we are not supposed to really think in things of being more powerful or anything like that, but... When I see Archangel Michael, I'm just so happy for like whoever has received that because it's a very um, strong angel all about defending um, protection, standing up for what's true and just and fair. Uh, turn to Michael if you need protection or if you need help being guided to your truth. Yeah, Archangel Michael, he says, the moment you say my name, I'm there. It's the same as all the angels, really. Archangel Jophiel, act with wisdom. Use information for the highest good. Whatever information comes from you, it feels like it's coming from Archangel Michael, and you're being asked to use it for the good, for the betterment of humanity and yourself, your life. Begin with fixing yourself first. Always. Always. Self-care. Then you start to mirror things that are loving. Okay, so angel answers for Aquarius. Wow. A year from now, and yes. A year from now, and yes. So that's positive. That looks positive. All right, angel numbers. And then we're going to get into a tarot, Aquarius. On the you don't need to worry, maybe about a partnership. It says two, you have a great talent for finding solutions. Your intuitive, unbiased nature allows you to see all sides of this situation and advise others towards the most fair and beneficial outcome. I am diplomatic. That sounds like something that Michael would be very um, happy to have described himself to. Serving in love. Serving in love. All right, let's get um, let's get a card now to start off your tarot spread for Aquarius. What's the issue, tarot? What do we have as the issue for Aquarius? King of Pentacle energy. So whoever is like um, heading up a business or um, the master entrepreneur, the very well taught and the well um a good mentor for business the king of pentacles could be taurus virgo capricorn capricorn what is the challenge here oh. it, it, it hid away almost like it was shoved away the five of pentacles is indicating a uh financial change so this is the challenge though the financial change something about the financial change is providing a challenge to you or how something's being run whether it be a family or a business here what's at the root of this well what is at the root of this aquarius is a new beginning it's a fresh new beginning what is at the root or at the base is the full energy could be Aries, but there's definitely focus on something being brand new for you. In the past, we have the energy of the Seven of Swords. So feeling deceived from the past, in the past, or you could have been in this energy yourself, but it's shaken off that energy for a brand new start and not looking at things like they're always going to be that way. 
maybe feeling ignored in a situation or abandoned. It just depends on what this general reading, you know, is focused on for you, what it resonates for you. Um, present energy here. Hangman in reverse. This is about coming out of that energy of feeling like you're just kind of hanging here, getting a better perspective, but lots of self-sacrifice. It's time. You're coming out of that. Something divine is happening, and you're coming out of that energy of waiting for it. Okay, so near future energy. This is looking good, Aquarius. Oh, Ace of Cups, something that didn't work out on the love front. Making something even, though. Coming back to make some, somebody who disappointed you in love, okay? Somebody who really hurt your heart, it feels like, is coming back to make something balanced and fair to, in a sense, make up for the hurt they caused with this Ace of Cups that it feels like they took. Um, we have the Two of Wands. So this is the energy of being very focused, to up here, to. This could be twin flame energy. This could be focusing on a new job or a new career. It's also saying keep yourself open to lots of possibilities and handle all things with love. The Six of Pentacles is about the give and take. It can be about giving or assisting charity um, or receiving charity for yourself. And it's also talking about sometimes justice issues where it's like a what goes around comes around. All right, so the lovers here... The lover's card is representing, let's see, this was near future, you, how you are feeling. You're feeling like you have good thoughts, good decisions, good partnership here. Either it's with yourself, your higher self, spirit, or somebody else, um, or like a job or some kind of business relationship. Could be uh, talking about Gemini. What is the surrounding circumstance? Or Aquarius was the surrounding whoa circumstance change maybe some people are arguing change um, this change is because the divine timing I feel I really feel is now so there's change coming around you there are people trying to fight this change you might be fighting a change but your angels are saying no let us guide you let us make this balance for you let us handle this fight. And that's what Michael's also saying is let me handle the fighting part process. The part of getting rid of negative attachments to yourself, possibly. Things that are blocking you. It might be outside influence. So let your spirit team handle these things. Hopes and fears. Whoa. <laughs> To get a family situation good again, rest, recover from an ace of pentacles, like an opportunity that you maybe took uh, that helped you recover from something or that is helping you recover maybe from something financially or from being hurt, like in the past with this seven of swords energy. This is long-term stability for a family system or soulmate energy coming to offer that. Or this is like really great new opportunities in money, finance, and a healing. Maybe even making back losses. Okay, the uh, probable outcome here. Probable outcome. Probable outcome is the Four of Pentacles standing in your power, even around conflict. The conflict is here because of the change. So even around conflict, you're still able to regain your power, invest in yourself, personal development. It's really great. That's a good card to get. The Four of Pentacles is like saving back, um, holding back, maybe not partaking in this. Um, I don't know. Do you know how I'm seeing the Five of Swords right now? Even though it is evident that there's conflict right here, I'm seeing this as him keeping his swords close to him, to himself. The same way this Four of Pentacles is keeping something to themselves. Not either telling everybody about this or not joining this conflict because you're keeping, it's like, I don't know, Pentacles to yourself? Six, six. Need for balance. Create um, create good things with positive, positive thoughts. A reassessment. Let's get something else on this outcome. Three of Wands, you don't see it coming. 
You don't see this outcome. Oh, they don't see this outcome coming. That's what it is. And it's because the three of wands is in reverse with all of these. They don't see this because of you keeping something all to yourself. Let's get another deck here. See if we can clarify what's going on here with this outcome. Strength. It may have to do with the Leo and pentacles here. Building up your strength, stepping into your power is the issue. Focusing on stepping into your power, okay? This is being more powerful. Stepping into your truth. Anything else? For Aquarius, anything else? Oh, I see the star on the bottom and she was upright. I should have pulled it. Magician. The magician is here to help you create whatever it is you're wanting. You're wanting to create something really big. I even see this as business, profit from business, investing back into the business. There's something that you created, and it's a manifestation. It's just beautiful here. And it's something that, like I said, other people don't expect. I think this is something you expect. But maybe not of success to the degree that you're going to get it, though. I feel like it's going to be big for you. Dogs getting together with friends. I'm sorry. Hit my head on the on that. April for somebody that needs a date. Sometimes those come out. Fan romance celebration or a party. Older man dealings or relationship with an older man. Cobwebs. You'll be protected from negative forces beyond your control. That's that Archangel Michael. I promise that's the energy from that. And then ear good news. One more for you, flowers, happiness. Flowers and happiness with this new start, with this partnership. Yeah, your angels are definitely helping you behind the scenes, Aquarius. Thanks so much for joining me, guys. Send you love and light as usual. I still offer private readings just um, kind of for donations. Just allow about 24 hours for them to come back to you. If you're interested in that, it's in the description box. And bye. See you next time.